Biomarkers of Duchenne Muscular Dystrophy – Current Findings Numerous biomarkers have been unveiled in the rapidly evolving biomarker discovery field with an aim to improve the clinical management of disorders. In rare diseases such as Duchenne muscular dystrophy, this endeavour has created a wealth of knowledge that, if effectively exploited, will benefit affected individuals with respect to healthcare, therapy, improved quality of life and increased life expectancy. Duchenne muscular dystrophy is caused by a mutation in the DMD gene, encoding for the dystrophin protein. The disorder is characterized by increasing muscle damage and loss of motor function with fatal outcome. Several diagnostic biomarkers are used to diagnose this disorder and classify the phenotype, but few biomarkers are sensitive enough to monitor disease progression and establish treatment outcome. Prenatal diagnostics is offered if family members are known to be carriers of genetic mutations in the dystrophin gene. Increased activity and abundance of creatine kinase in blood is an important muscular damage biomarker used in young children with delayed motor function development. Creatine kinase analysis can also be performed in blood spots, enabling for the development of prospective newborn screening. Ultimately, genetic testing is used to establish the diagnosis and the mutation, and the abundance of dystrophin protein in muscles is used as a biomarker that confirms the consequence of the mutations. The most promising findings and molecular biomarkers are inspected in this review, with an aim to provide an overview of currently known biomarkers and the technological developments. Single nucleotide polymorphisms in the gene encoding for latent TGF beta binding protein 4 has been shown to be of prognostic value. In a similar way, genetic variation in the SPP1 gene has been identified as a predictive biomarker candidate. Several molecules have been identified as potential treatment safety biomarkers and pharmacodynamic biomarkers. In particular, Biomarker qualifications and surrogate endpoints are needed to facilitate the development of novel treatments. Biomarkers as cells, genetic variations, mRNAs, proteins, lipids and metabolites indicative of disease severity, progression and treatment response have the potential to improve development and approval of therapies, clinical management of DMD and patients' life quality. In this review, we also highlight the complexity of translating research results to clinical use, emphasizing the need for biomarkers fit for purpose and describe the challenges associated with qualifying them for clinical applications.